What's up guys and welcome to the tarot. I am the energy and intuitive reader and I'm here to do... Ooh, I just thought of something. <laughs> the love spread for somebody. I'm thinking about what I'm going to make for dinner. Some of you guys might be having dinner while you're watching me. Hey, hey, Tartar. <laughs> what's up, Tartarissa? Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. Let's see what's going on between you and your person. I hope you guys are doing beautifully well today. We're going to do a love spread. But clarify. And yeah. Taurus. Alright. The relationship as of now is a king of pentacles. Very abundant. Very stable. Very fruitful. This could be with a Taurus Virgo Capricorn. But this is very solid here okay like i feel like both of you guys together are becoming very abundant you guys are are making the relationship abundant anything you touch turns abundant like <laughs> this is good uh, this is a really good um crowning energy for the relationship how do you feel the queen of wands oh you feel sassy okay you feel you feel like um you feel very attractive in the with this person um or you're very attracted to this person um that's nice um how does your partner feel the seven of pentacles they feel like this has a lot of potential i feel like they're looking at how far you guys have come everything that you guys have done this person could be like really in thinking mode right now um what's the obstacles and blocks the two of cups a mutual understanding about the relationship um, what's the best approach is a strength card. Hold on. Hold on. What's the potential future? The sun in reverse. No. Unhappiness? Why? The ten of wands in reverse. The eight of wands in reverse. Three of pentacles. The devil. The hangman. The father. Okay. So it could be that there might be some type of... Um, disconnect or delay in communication with you and this person because it's like or it could be you right but it's like one of you two here um has to work on detaching themselves from something that no longer is working um it's like somebody has to make peace with something in order for you and them to flourish and within that time that they're making peace with whatever this is the communication might um the communication might not be so good, but they're, you know, they're working on it. This is like somebody like working, working out on themselves so that they can improve their health for their children, for their kids, you know, like something like that. Yeah. Like this person isn't going anywhere. They might leave for a little bit, but they'll be right back. They got to go take care of something. <laughs> Ten of wands is in reverse. So that's dropping a burden, dropping challenges. I feel like they have to, someone has to do this in order for, the, for this to be a little easier. What is the king of pentacles here for the relationship as of now? You have the queen of pentacles, the five of pentacles, and the eight of pentacles in reverse. So both of you guys are nurturing this situation. You guys are coming up as a true pair situation with the queen and king of pentacles. But both of you guys feel left out because you guys aren't putting, there isn't any, the effort that is being put into it, I feel like it's not enough. And both of you guys feel that way. Yep, this is both of your guys' wish here. Um, I feel like you both feel like the other doesn't hold themselves accountable for the lack of effort in the situation. So basically, both of y'all feel like you're lazy. Both of y'all feel like both of each other is lazy. Okay, but I don't feel like it's that's getting to you or them. It's just an observation. Okay. What is the Queen of Wands here? Or how Taurus feels? You know, the chariot could be a cancer. You could have that in your chart. Bottom of the deck is the ace of swords in reverse. The chariot in reverse, the two of pentacles in reverse, and the king of pentacles in reverse. <sighs> this makes you uncomfortable. The fact that you feel good about your... <sighs> Why? Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is a lesson that you're learning with the hierophant here. 
This is a lesson that you're learning and your intuition is telling you this. Your intuition is telling you that this matches your morals and your values. But there's something about it, Taurus, that I feel like brings out the good in you, but it could bring out, it could also highlight the, the lack in someone else. And that could be what is like, you're just like, no, why is this so hard? But it's hard because you're you're meant to learn a lesson. I feel like it's hard because you're making it hard. I want to pull these. Let me see. No. I'm going to get another deck. You're the only sign I have to do this for. So it could be that this is the only person that could, that could um, help you with this. Why is the chariot in reverse, the king of pentacles in reverse, and the two of pentacles in reverse? You're showing me like this is too much. This is too much. Two of swords in reverse, the knight of swords, and the two of cups. But you're not going nowhere. <laughs> they aren't going nowhere. Like, you're going to decide to invest in this anyways. Yes, because you get what you put into the situation. I, like I said, there's something about this that rubs you the wrong way. But that's because you're learning a lesson. This is your card here. And you're upright. So... Your soul, your intuition is speaking to you highly about this situation. You might not like that this person is so attractive. Um, you might not like how this person makes you feel attractive because maybe you haven't felt like that before. And that could like, you're just like, okay, like whatever. Like I get it. Like, ah. But it's like, you need this, right? Like you, like, you know, with the, with the high friend, this is a lesson that you have to learn. Okay. All right, let's keep going. What is this um, Seven of Pentacles here for how Taurus person feels? The Two of Pentacles, the Four of Cups in reverse, and the Ace of Pentacles in reverse with the King of Cups. This person loves you a lot. Um, they have the Ace of Pentacles in reverse, the Four of Cups in reverse, and the Two of Pentacles. This person could be like really pessimistic, you know, they're kind of like, I feel like Taurus isn't, isn't going to accept, like they want to offer you something, but they feel like you're not going to accept it. They're, they are already saying that you're not going to accept it without them even trying to offer it. They do care about you here and they like that you give them equal give and take, but they, this person could have, um, that might not take care of, of themselves well with the page of pentacles in reverse but again they feel like they're not you wouldn't take what they have here um <laughs> i feel like it's because the way that you come off here taurus like i said there's something here about this situation that like rubs you the wrong way but it's because you're going through you're learning a lesson you're learning a very important lesson um and it could be that some of you this person could feel that like i said this person could be more intuitive then i'm gonna say that to you um, this person could be very intuitive, a lot more intuitive than you know, than they're speaking about, you know, and it's like they can feel that you're kind of resisting this change, this transformation to happen. And you're just like showing, yeah, I'm happy, -doo 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 -doo. but they can feel that you're resisting out the wazoo, you know? So there's that. Maybe some reassurance, you know, to this person so they know. What is this Two of Cups here? for um the obstacles and blocks you have the death card in reverse the king of wands in reverse and the six of swords um So if you're the one that has to go through this transformation, Taurus, I feel like you're the one that's blocking this. Um, there is a transformation that needs to happen that's pissing someone else off. But that's the way to move forward. And I feel like the, the death card is you in reverse. Okay, There's, it could be them. Take it how it resonates. But someone does have to go through a transformation and they don't like it. It's like pulling teeth. <laughs> but they're going to be very abundant. Um, and it could be that somebody could be trying to bring other people with them or not letting go of the things that need to go in their life that is causing havoc um what is the strength card here for the best approach the 
the Chariot, the Seven of Wands in reverse, and the Hierophant in reverse. So the best approach is to keep going towards this here. Um, I'm going to be honest. Even if you feel uneasy, like you're going to feel uneasy because this is a lesson that you have to, you, you got you to gotta make it past this level. You know, you, you're not going to get to level seven unless you finish level six. There is no way. And there is no cheating allowed. So good luck with that let <laughs> me stop but yeah they don't want you to fight this off here they want you to run towards it and i know you don't want to it makes you feel like what the freak but you're learning a lesson okay and this is a good lesson too don't be scared don't be scared what is the sun in reverse you have the hermit the five of wands in reverse and the six of wands in reverse so it's like, I feel like there's going to be some unhappiness here because somebody might want to like go for a break or it's like somebody might go on a like hiatus real quick, like on a peaceful, leave me alone for a quick second. Um, because, and I don't think it has anything to do with their relationship. I think there could be some type of financial um, situation here or business or whatever it is that you guys are doing that is not working out so well and someone's like i need a minute like i need a minute to get myself together like just give me a second um and that's why the sun is even even the sun is in reverse isn't isn't even that bad um but yeah i don't feel like this person is going to um i don't feel like this person is going anywhere so you don't have to worry they're just trying to figure out what the freak they're gonna do about something that's not working in their life okay all right, Taurus, all that I have for you. I hope this helped. Have a good day or a good night whenever you watch this and stay positive. positive.